Whew, it looks sensational, everybody. I just want to say right now that, wow. Everyone, the Costco Bakery is a magical, delicious place. So many options. What is going on everybody, Eric the Electric come back to you guys again with another video. Ladies and gentlemen, we're jumping straight into this one today folks because in this video everybody, we're going to be taking on the most delicious items at the Costco Bakery. Everyone, it's been ages since I've done a baked goods challenge. I actually don't think I've done a baked goods challenge in actually like ever. And everyone, after last week's epic fail, Ooh, I'm dead. I need redemption. So without further ado, folks, let's go get us some big goods. No samples, no samples, no samples. This comes in a pack of two, I think. I can't even go pick any other for the same price. Okay, I think I'm good with this one today. But you have to take two. It'll come in one. <laughs> I, I have, to take, have to take two. Yeah, these, the bread, and the game shoes. Alright, so Costco must be really trying to get rid of their big goods because apparently they won't let me leave unless I get two packs of muffins. Alrighty, Electric Empire, we have our cart full of deliciousness right here. I'm very excited to get into this one, everybody. We have a lot of delicious items to eat. But before we get into this bakery challenge, everybody, we gotta grab the essentials. All right, everybody, we have our essentials and our Costco goodies now. It's time to get this home and get this all presentable. Alrighty, Electric Game Park, we have all of our Costco baked good deliciousness on this table right here, folks. I'm super excited for this one. Everybody, I love baked goods, and you should too. Baked goods are delicious. Just not always that nutritious. We have our six count blueberry muffins over here. We have our Costco assorted cookies. We have our Costco cheesecake. We have our Costco baguettes. We have our Costco croissants. And everyone, they would not let me leave unless I got another pack of muffins. Because they have a deal going on right now, apparently, where you get any two six packs for the price of one. And I know what you guys are gonna say before I say this. I know what you're gonna say. You're gonna go, Eric, why not just eat both of the six packs? Well, let me just tell you guys right now that with all this, without this included, this is over 10 pounds worth of baked goods. So that being said, everybody, we're gonna have the best of both worlds. We're gonna mix and match our muffins, but I won't be eating two six packs of muffins. It will make a great thumbnail, though. Anyways, everybody, hopefully you guys are having a great day out there whenever you guys are watching this video. I'm excited to get into this one, folks. We have our essentials right here, everybody. Let's get everything all wrapped and get everything all presentable. You guys are probably wondering, Eric, why did you get sugar-free jam? And I can't believe it's not buttery, even though you got real butter and real cheese. Everybody, there's always room for health and fitness in this party. Oh, goodness gracious, everyone. It looks magnificent. It looks sensational. It looks magical. Everyone, that is a Costco cheesecake for you right there. And ladies and gentlemen, that is a dense cheesecake, all right? That is that is a chunky cheesecake. It's almost as chunky as me. Oh my gosh, it's like the, oh, it's like the perfect centerpiece. Oh, I'm so glad I got that. It's just not gonna feel too good tomorrow. All right, everybody, and then we had to get our coffee cake muffins right here. Like I said, I'm gonna do three and three. It's like a baseball bat, man. Goodness gracious. Anyways, we got our baguette right there. Oh, Whew. it looks sensational, everybody. I just wanna say right now that, wow. Oh my goodness, I don't even know where to begin. Um, everybody, this is going to be a pretty insane challenge. Like I mentioned earlier, I really, 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 need to get redemption after last week's video because that was an epic fail. But now everybody, it's time to get back to a food challenge. It's time to get redemption, hopefully. And let me just tell you guys, I'm ready for this one. That being said, Electric Empire, it's time to get this challenge started and it's time to get this one underway. That means I gotta let you guys know the total calories that are in this challenge. Those are gonna be listed like right there for you guys. And total macros, that means protein, carbs, fats. Mm, lots of sugar. 
It's gonna be lots of sugar in this challenge. Those are gonna be listed like right there for you guys. Without further ado, my friends, my family, members of the Electric Empire, this is the ultimate Costco Bakery Challenge. Let's do this. Alrighty, Electric Empire, we are ready to get this challenge started. We are ready to get this one underway, but before we do though, just like with every challenge, everybody, I need to ask you a very important question. You know, help out, whoa. But really guys, if you haven't already, you guys gotta give the video a like and give poop today. I think I'm gonna get into our croissants first. But before we do though, we gotta start with some health and fitness. Now, Electric Empire, it is time to get this Costco bakery menu challenge started. Here we go. What can I say? I love croissants. Let's get into it, folks. All right, guys, well, so far, it's going amazing, but you didn't, come on, people, you know I, I'm not gonna actually use spray butter. Spray butter's great, but I'm gonna not use that. I'll pick that up later. The health and fitness. Oh. Okay, I guess not. We'll just actually pretend like that never happened. All right, but well, it's certainly been a very doughy challenge. All right, guys, well, our croissants are almost down. Let's see what we gotta do here. I think, everybody, it's time to amp things up a little bit more. But what you can do, everybody, is innovate. You guys know how we do it. In the Electric Empire, we innovate with some cookie action. So what we're gonna do right now is take cookie like so, and then you stuff it inside the croissant, just like that. And everybody, you just don't stop there. Electric Empire, why settle for less? Why settle for less? And then you have peanut buttery deliciousness and you have an extravaganza of flavor. Here we go. Woo! W! Oh! W moment! I'm telling you guys right now, if you don't understand the combo, I get it, but it, actually, yeah, I know it's just a cookie with peanut butter inside of it, it's fun, but you guys gotta try it. It's absolutely legendary. All right, guys, well, we've eliminated the first hardest item. Now we gotta get to the next thing right here, which is our cheesecake. Everyone, after I attempted to eat every single slice of cheesecake on the Cheesecake Factory menu, I was like, you know what? It's gonna be a while before I eat an insane amount of cheesecake again, but you know what? Here we are. And there we have it, my friends and family, a slice of Costco cheesecake, and I have no idea why I sliced this, because I'm just gonna eat this like a savage, but here we go. Oh, snap. Oh, I guess there goes 10 calories. Anyways, oh wait, kids. Don't eat cheesecake off of a knife. It's not good. Anyways, boom. Woo! Woo! All right, everybody. Well, we got out rich Costco cheesecake tart. Good thing we can spruce them up a little bit with some more unnecessary calories. Come on, just, just, just work out. Just there we go. Oh, Alright guys, well I think half of our cheesecake is down right here. And you know I talk a lot about innovation. Oh, we're gonna create something glorious. Something magical. Let's do it. Goodness gracious. You need a moment. Guys, well, a little bit of cheesecake left. So glad I have some bag. 
don't know where I'd be without my health. Let's finish off the last of this cheesecake. Water cheesecake is down. Next, everybody, it's time to move on. We have our muffins left, our cookies. Oh, why did I get this? I think we're gonna get into our muffins next. Everyone, muffins just always, always at the spot. Just, I guess, not when you have a thousand calories worth of croissants, cookies, and cheesecake inside of you already. Don't worry, I love my muffins. Whatever muffins you guys like, drop a comment down below. For me, blueberry muffins have always been a classic. But what can I say, everybody? I love all muffins. <sighs> Here we go. Boom. Oh my goodness, precious. Oh wow. Oh my Alright guys, well, we're gonna head back to our glorious butter. Guys, well, three blue boy muffins are down. Ooh, I feel like the bread baby's kicking in right now. It's slowly kicking inside me. Oh, that's like I'm about to give birth to him. Feels very good, boy. We make ourselves a semi healthy snack right here. Your sugar free jam. And then some peanut butter, just like so. And then you have yourselves a peanut butter and jelly. We have one muffin left. I can't even talk right now. Oh my goodness gracious, I feel horrible. All right, guys. Well, the Costco muffins are down. My goodness gracious, why did I get two of these? I'm gonna have to resort to tactics for those, but now everybody, I think it's time to get into our Costco cookies next. And I realize everyone that we have two out of our three Costco cookies left because I took down the chocolate chip ones. But if you guys have a favorite between oatmeal raisin and white chocolate macadamia nut, white chocolate chip macadamia nut, you guys gotta comment down below. As I said earlier, I'm not a fan, just simply not a fan of white chocolate macadamia nut, white chocolate chip macadamia nut, whatever it is, but we gotta get it down. Here we go. Well, it's actually not that bad. I thought we were gonna have an AWW moment, but we're good. as well. The white chocolate chip macadamia nuts are down. Oh my goodness gracious. Yeah, I just really don't want to even look at this right now. You guys know what I'm about to do and it's just not going to be pretty. gonna happen eventually. Mm. It's just a flesh wound. Okay, that's definitely not a flesh wound. Alright, let you go part wall. I'm bleeding, which really sucks. It's okay. I guess not that bad, right? Sorry, you probably lost your appetite if you're eating with me while watching this challenge, but food challenges aren't pretty. Ugh, we got this everybody, we can do this. I'm not feeling two challenges two weeks in a row. There's no way. Oh my goodness, great. Hold me a raisin right now. W. Oh. Yep. Oh, why do you exist? Curse you, Costco, for selling these in two packs. Curse you. Oh. 
I'm gonna just do a full video. Well, once you comment down below, it's hippo. I don't know if you're watching hippo right now. And also, stay tuned for next week's video. Everyone, we have a traditional, or my take on a traditional English breakfast right here, and I couldn't be any more excited to bring this to you guys. Bless your breakfast. Just like that electric part. Oh, that's one of the most insane challenges I've ever done. Like I said earlier, I'm really glad that I trained for that. We got the challenge completed. If you guys enjoyed the video, be sure to let me know down in the comments below. Don't forget, if you guys want to keep watching more everything lunch, be sure to check out my playlist down below. The party does not have to end here, everybody. Thanks for watching the video, everybody. I'll see you next week.